what you do with those with the struggle what you do with the downtime what you do with the things are not lining up not going how I thought they should go mean everything right those things will actually determine whether or not if how when and how much of the positive times that you have the the hard times are actually the thing that show you the potential that you have left untapped or you can say I am going to hug this situation. This thing is part of me. I'm not going to wish it away, try to escape it. I'm not going to not try to think about it anymore. I'm just going to wish it never happened, pretend everything is totally fine, and just go on with my life. Instead of looking inward, when people face difficulties, I feel like that's what most people do, right? They turn inward, like everything out there is dangerous. And so I need to just protect myself. And so if I create this space where, no one can reach me and no one can touch me. Then I'm just safe in my little cocoon. And what actually ends up happening is that you become so self-focused, so self-focused on either your problem or your lack of things that you think you should be having or all the things that people who should have been doing more for you in your life didn't do and how, how they just deserve to not be in communication with you anymore. Um, you know, all of these are really toxic ways of thinking and they will never put you over uh to the place where you actually want to be if you don't interact with the struggles with the hard things with the trying times in a correct way you're going to miss the opportunity of growth all struggles i just want to say it again i want to hammer home this point to you all struggles are meant to pull out the missed potential that you have you are overlooking potential in your life and struggle is meant to push or pull that out of you. Uh, you you will never realize that full potential without that struggle. And so uh, and so just like you, you you know the weight is heavy, right? I'm stepping up to the bar. I already know this is this is heavy. I'm gonna pick up some heavy weight now. Why is it a shock to me if I go up to the weight and I miss it the first time? the second time, the third time, maybe the fourth time, fifth time, sixth time. I don't care how many times it takes me. You know, I'm, I'm fixing to lift that weight, right? I'm not, I'm not walking away like, well, could do all the other ones. Just not that one. That one. No, couldn't do it. Absolutely not. That thought would never even cross my mind. And yet in life, how many times do we say to ourselves, um, well, if I was meant to do that, I would have been successful at it. Oh, I tried it. You didn't try it for one time. You tried it for one day. You tried it for one hour right? You did it for such a short amount of time and you're frustrated because you didn't get the result. Well, I prayed for it. And if it didn't come to me that time I prayed, then not meant to be moving on to the next thing. So many people leave their destinies. They walk away from, from everything that they're meant to have because they refuse to engage with the struggle. When I face a negative situation, when I face something that comes out of the blue, something that is disruptive to my life, something that is alarming to me, even something that's traumatic. Like I never think, um, okay, well, this is it. You know, looks like I'm a failure. Looks like I'm going to have to start all over. I'm throwing everything out. I, I have to get it together and come up with a different plan, different vision, different, whatever. This is part of me. This is part of my learning experience. It's part of me experiencing life as a human. I'm in a human body on a human planet. I'm on planet Earth, full of struggle. There's not a single thing on the planet that doesn't do it. Why do I think I'm special that I, I won't have I won't have struggles? And in fact, I know I will. Shift your perspective and you'll get the outcome that you're after in, in the whole first place a lot quicker. You can start crafting a story at any point in time. Right now, today, right this second, right now, not not after this call, right now on this call, you can start crafting yourself a different story. It's all about the what you are willing to suffer for. Are you willing to suffer if it meant that you would have a different outcome? You know, problems never go away. They just take different shape. Everybody has money problems, okay? Warren Buffett, money problems. The homeless guy in the street begging for money, uh, money problems. They both have money problems. They have different types of problems. Those problems have taken on a different shape, a different form. So what type of problem are you willing to have?